Good day, it is Tuesday, May 14th, leaving the Big Bear Hostel, 7 a.m. shuttle time. <clears throat> we are back at the trailhead. They said it'd take like 30 minutes and like a 15 minute drive. PC tickets he's on right there, but we're not going to take off. He's who I, who I roomed with last week. Well, <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> the past few days. Uh, it's a nice cool day. Nice views down there. Nice big parking lot. There's like some water over there that we had when uh, we were coming into town. Yeah, man, just a stretch. Have myself a little meeting and be out, bruh. Uh, big Bear was cool, man. Some of the most affordable lodging for hikers that I've ever come across. And I've been to a number of trail towns. Um, yeah, my boy Sparky pulled into town. He was like, yo, you want a zero? Well, I really wanted to, but my bad Sparky, I gotta keep moving. <laughs> gotta make miles, I don't know. Even though the Sierras are packed full of snow, I could take my time before getting there. Um, yeah, got some videos done. Around some good people. My gators keep ripping, so I keep uh, stitching them in town. They keep doing pretty well this time again. Um, I'm loving my elbows, I'm loving the fact that that front flap hasn't come down every time you hit a rock, like my Merrells did. Sorry, Merrell, it's just true. Uh, even my Hoka's did that shit too. But the, the Hoka, the elbows, they fuse in. You know what I'm saying? It's like fused into the front the shoe. So even when I was on the Sinto, my socks didn't get too wet because that whole rubber portion of the front part of the shoe is uh, protected. Anyways, kind of keep the day going. It's like me ish miles today hopefully 20 You know, um, yesterday when I was at Sarge's, I lost or misplaced all the memory cards that I use to vlog. And it was uh, pretty nerve wracking, you know, because I thought that was it. I thought I wasn't gonna be able to vlog anymore, or just like record any of this beautiful journey in this beautiful land, but. Someone luckily ended up turning my stuff in. I think these are Joshua trees. Yeah. Yeah, I lucked out. I'm pretty happy someone turned my stuff in. I mean, it is expensive, but it's not the uh, monetary value that I immediately thought of. It's the sentimental value. I really, you know, not that I edit them as professionally as possible but it's nice to see what I've been through where I've been how I was feeling happy to share the trail for those who can't hike it or for those who do want to hike it in the years to come it's beautiful last week I was in snow on Mount Jacinto freezing Woo! some valleys like Rostro campground a little valley in between, a little canyon in between mountains. That was freezing cold, you know. There was hail last week. I had no gut hooks last, last week. Really hard. Look at this. Oh my god. Yeah. Pretty resilient. Like, gosh. You know what I'm saying? I got some stuff on my legs. The ground giving out on me. At Mission Creek, but 
we out here, 10% done. Someone told me that, 250 miles, it's already 10% 10, 10 done. Made me a little sad. Dude. So I'm only about six and a half, six and a half miles in. It's noon. So far, my gut hooks failed me again, but I re-downloaded it. Anyways, so from what I've learned about the trail after Big Bear going into Wrightwood is that it's very cruisy, per se. It's been a gradual downhill for a while now. We had one little up or two, but it's been pretty cruisy. That's the word that the young ones are using. So yeah, um, it's going to be a big, a big mile day, at least 20 at least. We're already around like 10. So, we're going to keep it going. Shoot down. been a lot of this all day just the wooded area and it's been real nice hiking has been on a gradual downgrade today and very easy to enjoy a mile and a half a mile left to the summit of this one more uh, uphill and then downhill all the way to camp baby don't hurt me So Tuesday, May 14th, man, I did 14 and a quarter miles to a spot, uh, just overlooking a little uh, view. I had a group of people just leave right now. Um, uh, it was nice. The trail was beautiful. Uh, pretty much down, downhill the entire time, other than two little, like, uh, humps. And tomorrow I'm getting up really early and trying to go for 28 to Deep Creek where there's like hot springs. Everyone's planning to go there, so I guess uh, I'm going to jump on that bandwagon. Uh, it's really cold up here. I'm going to see if my Sawyer tonight. I'm going to get 8,000 feet. Um, yeah, I just carried a lot of the uh, food out of town this weekend. Uh, you don't really want to push it because, man, my shoulders start hurting sometimes. But, uh, uh, it feels good to be out here. Can't wait for, for tomorrow. It's really cold, though. So I know taking down my tent is going to be uh, a mission in the morning. <clears throat> but, yeah. Sun's about to set. I'm going to uh, take it down until tomorrow. <laughs>